Hi folks, in my job as a collaboration PSS, I spend a lot of time with both customers and partners, helping them get their head around the Cisco Unified Communications um, offering. And to be honest, not so much on the technical side of things, but rather helping partners and customers create tangible, easy to understand communications tools by using Cisco Unified Communications as a platform for things. This video has three objectives. If you are a Cisco partner, you can use this video as a blueprint for creating or developing your own Cisco powered service offering. If you are an existing customer using Unified Communication Solution from Cisco, you can use this video as a point of reference to your existing service offering. And if you are not yet running a Cisco Unified Communication Solution, you can use this video as an inspiration point and pick up and choose from the things I created and use the information when, for example, planning future investments. But before we get started, let's take a look at what kind of users and more importantly, what kind of user demands we see in the market at the moment. And once we've done this, let's look at the stuff I've cooked up. Roughly speaking, there are five different types of users. Mobile workers, who driven by productivity demands need to have the best and richest communications tools available on any device and on any network. Office workers, who do need to have communi good communications tools but are squeezed between the need for great solutions and a corporate need to keep costs down. Then we have executives who are driven by very similar needs as those of the mobile workers but are less mobile, but might need to have access to rich communications tools during evenings or for example weekends. We have non-office workers. These are the guys working on the factory floor or doing installations and traditionally these guys have not been part of a unified communication solutions. But as Bob Dylan would have put it, times they are changing. And finally we have experts. These are the folks whose expertise and insight your success is actually depending on. Their primary value to you is based on their ability to share and transfer their knowledge with colleagues, partners and customers. And to be able to do this, they need specific communications tools. Okay, enough with the user groups. Let's take a look at seven bundles that should be able to cover the needs of these user groups, either individually or combined. To start with, I believe you need to be able to build a service offering around one core brand name. I also believe you should be able to build service offerings for individual needs and not build any kind of one-size-fits-all offerings. In this particular case, I will use a completely made-up brand name. I'm going to call the service Cloud with the letter K and to add a bit of made-up funkiness, I've rotated the letter K horizontally. I'm also going to create a visually compelling, easy to understand description for each bundle with visual clues as to what the bundle actually includes. Each bundle will include a couple of specific product options and on the right you will be able to see which Cisco license is needed to power up the endpoints. Here's a quick snapshot of the seven bundles and as you can see each bundle conforms to the high level brand name from a look and feel perspective. Now, this is just my own personal way of doing branding and if you're a Cisco partner, you, you should of course use your own corporate look and feel and naming conventions for product offerings. Okay, let's start with the most basic bundle and let's call it Basic Suite. So, what do I think you would need to have in a Basic Suite? Well, to keep licensing costs down to a bare minimum, I would use either UCL Essential or UCL Basic licensing. This would drive the licensing cost down to a bare minimum, but would allow you to offer a number of different phone models depending on the need. And as a partner, you would be able to sell these bundles individually. And as a customer, you would be able to choose the amount of basic packages you would like to have. And to sweeten the deal, I would suggest throwing in instant messaging and presence for all basic pack users, completely free of charge. Now, this would mean that a basic pack user would have a desktop phone and, and instant messaging and presence on any device. For example, on his or her iPhone or Samsung tablet. Okay, remember the five user groups I talked about before. I would use this bundle for the office worker user group who, for whatever reason, are more productive using hard phones than soft phones. And do remember that by handing out instant messaging and presence tools to these users, you would be able to upgrade to standard voice or IP and video soft phones at a later stage if needed. Okay folks, one down, six to go. The following bundle I would take to market should be something more advanced and that's why I would like to call it Advanced Suite. 
Consisting of UCL enhanced and enhanced plus licensing, this bundle would allow a partner to deploy rich, unified communications on any device to individual users. As a user, you would have the choice of choosing the form of communication that would make you as an individual and a contributor as productive as possible. As an example, you can have um, a voice over IP and HD video enabled soft phone on your laptop and an EX90 telepresence unit at the office or your home office. Due to its relatively low licensing cost, you could roll this out to a large portion of an organization and control operational cost by standardizing the use of endpoints. The most cost-efficient deployment would be one where you roll out voice over IP and HD video enabled soft phones on a laptop or a tablet. Great, two bundles down. Don't give up on me. Keep on watching because things are getting smoking hot. You definitely want to watch the following. And let's talk about executives, their needs and see if we are able to create specific bundles for this particular target group. Let's see what an executive suite could look like. Remember the user groups from before? Good. Executives can or at least should have the best and richest forms of communications if we uh, use a unified workspace license standard in the background. This would give an executive things like HD video on a personal telepresence endpoint, video calling on a soft phone on any device, voice or IP on any device, single number reach, voicemail and instant messaging and presence on any device. Folks, this is the mother of all bundles. And, and this is really important. If you build this bundle using a business edition 6000 configuration, you will get 25 of these licenses at almost no cost. Now, I'm pretty sure we can find 25 executives who want to go full Monty on their communications tools. Okay, before we soldier on, let's make a quick recap. First, we talked about the basic suite for users with very basic needs. Then we talked about the advanced suite and then the executive suite. These three bundles form the basic foundation for personal, rich communications. But I have four more bundles, and these bundles form a layer of additional value-adding services that can be deployed for specific needs of specific individuals as time progresses and more services are required. Now, do remember the five user groups we talked about in the beginning. These user groups are not stationary. People actually migrate between these user groups and roles change or the way we communicate matures. First, let's go mobile, and let's see if we're able to address a very specific need with Cisco-powered bundle and I'm talking about tablets. We already know tablets and phablets are becoming more and more popular within corporates. Thanks to a worldwide cooperation between Cisco and Samsung, we're able to offer WebEx Meeting Center completely free of charge for six months, bundled with Samsung Galaxy Note Pro and Samsung Galaxy Tab Pro. So why don't we call this add-on bundle a tablet suite? As a reseller, you can offer this as part of a branded service by marrying up the best business-grade tablets with the best web conferencing solution in the market. You could either sell this as a standalone service or, as I would suggest, as an add-on to your existing service offering. My second add-on bundle is kind of related to the previous bundle, the tablet suite, but it's more geared towards laptop users. I would like to call this bundle the web meeting suite. There are two different kinds of licensing I would use in the background. Either an enterprise licensing offering for WebEx called Active Host, or a small business offering for WebEx. You can see the product codes here on the right. The first one will allow you to roll out WebEx uh, conference to all employees at a super affordable per user price. And the latter one will allow you to roll out as little as two licenses at a time. You can of course do anything in between, but I would take one more step in making the offering as compelling as possible. I would add an HD precision camera and a Jabber speakerphone to the offering. Folks, this is the holy trinity of web conferencing. WebEx, a superb web camera and the best speakerphone on the market. My third add-on bundle is focusing on room-based telepresence and I'm going to call it simply Video Suite. This add-on should not be mixed with the Executive Suite. The Executive Suite focuses on personal telepresence whereas the Video Suite focuses on room-based telepresence. Thanks to the Video Bundle, you can now deploy individual video endpoints at a predictable low cost. And by weaving in licenses for Expressway C and Expressway E and traversal call licenses with the Telepresence Room license, you're able to associate cost with a particular endpoint to particular meeting rooms. One video endpoint, one monthly cost. My fourth and final add-on bundle uses the built-in audio conferencing feature of Cisco Unified Communications Manager. Now, 
This is a feature that is already built in, but surprisingly enough, it is not utilized extensively. And as a partner, you could build an off offering around this feature and provide this as a basic add-on service. There are of course limitations to the number of concurrent audio conference participants, but I see no reason why you shouldn't offer this as a separate service that can be built out later on. Folks, I have deliberately left out two more potential bundles that could be built because I will cover these in separate videos. One is built around virtual meeting rooms and the other one is focusing on contact center services. So here's the recap. I believe there are five key user groups within any organization and that these and each of these user groups have their own specific communications needs. For these user groups, I've created three core bundles, basic, advanced and executive suites. That said, I also believe that individuals migrate between the user groups and that the communication needs within each user group is continuously evolving. For these two reasons, I've created four add-on bundles that will help a customer capture and support a continuous drive for productivity. That's it. If you are interested in getting a bill of material for these bundles, feel free to reach out to me. You can find my contacts here, here and here. Thanks for watching.